What's going on? It's Alexander here, back with some more Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Let's go talk with our grandfather. What are you doing out here? That is something I wanted to ask you. Will you fish with me? So many things I want to talk about. Talk then. After everything you lost at Thermopylae, your men, your wife, your children, Sparta, in the end, was it worth it? Who rules the Greek world right now? Greeks. Then my answer is yes. Mother told me of our bloodline and our ancestors. Did you know? Only what my mother taught me. We were born from greatness, and we were destined for greatness. The world was divided in two. Those who wanted us dead, and those who would follow us to the gates of Hades. I imagine the spear was in one piece when it was given to you. My mother handed it to me when I was a boy. Said it came with a certain burden, but... You were ready. It's so peaceful here. I think I got a bite. Get a basket, quickly. Grandfather, I... You are here to kill me. In Sparta, we were trained to spot predators long before they pounced. I need Persephone's approval, but she sees you as a threat. If I don't take care of that threat... Why not bring her the head of a greater threat? Who's a greater threat than you? Actually, there is someone. A spy. I delivered him to Persephone as a bodyguard, but he's working against her from the inside. I am only a threat to her soldiers on the battlefield. A spy threatens the heart of Elysium. Bring her his corpse, and she should be satisfied. Thank you, Grandfather. We should go fishing more often. Faith Southeastern Park. <sighs> Makes sense, I guess. Do that. Kiros alive, she can deal with the traitor herself. Mm. I just don't know how to feel about all this. Cause he did, he seemed like a good, Gyro seemed like a good guy. But... Ah, uh, God, this has some dilemmas.
This DLC has quite some dilemmas here. I'm really just not sure how to feel about all this, you know? You knocked out to be brought up live. Well, yeah, of course. A few issues here. Quite a few, actually. Holy crap. Boom. He is very tough.
him. He is tough. Come on, just fall over unconscious. Damn. Over unconscious. Can't risk hitting you again. You're so low health. There we go. Come on, just jump down from there. Home, pl home free, home free. Make sure we don't jump off any cliffs. Again. I'm thinking if she, like, takes over his mind, we can uh, go and save him eventually, is what I'm hoping. of Zarax? This isn't who I asked for. He's a spy working for the Rebellion. But you're the one who first brought him to me. I didn't know his intentions. I trusted you. Guards! Persephone, listen to me. Hermes is right. Trouble's brewing in Elysium. Even though Leonidas is against you, you are much stronger than he is. But Kiros was an enemy you couldn't see. That made him far more dangerous to you and Elysium. But he's still breathing. Death is a gift traitors don't deserve. I thought you'd want to deal with him yourself. Defying me comes at a cost. Our deal is off. But for bringing me this vile deceiver, you may stay. Figure out that mysterious little staff of yours. I was going to want to be a double cross any which way, so... I'd like to take her out right now. To Adonis. Do you believe that is... No, we don't have the helmet yet. 
Do everything else but the helmet. Tra we'll try to travel here, here and then get going in... Probably in the next one. Probably in this one a little early. But yeah, I know it's... Like, yeah, even though I don't like betraying heroes, it's probably for the better. Because we need a general to lead the troops. But, like I said, though, I am going to end this one a little early, so thank y'all for watching. And I'll see you in the next one, where we see if we're finally going to fight Persephone and where that goes from there. So yeah, thanks for watching. See you then.